third time is the charm. Hey! So let's try doing this uh, snipe thingy. Uh, I'll count down from four, from five, and then I'll press battle, and let's hope it works. No desert wolves. I didn't win a uh, Polish DD, as far as I know. I don't see it. Nope. No Polish DD. Stream snipe. The benefits of having the stream on a laptop. I can do a countdown with my left hand and press the battle button with my right hand. <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> Who needs mods? <laughs> I hate playing my carrier when I've got a double, another one on my side. It's a oh, nightmare battle earlier. Really. Thank you, Desert Wolves. I really appreciate it. Uh, now if I use the laptop to have the stream so I can watch what you guys are writing while I play on my main rig and got the streaming uh, system or streaming program on my main rig. So I'm not streaming on two uh, from two computers. I'm just uh, using the laptop to basically surf the internet on. I got like twelve, thirteen tabs open in my web browser, and six of them are different streams. But there's only one active at the moment, and that's me. But I got the, the the streams I frequent the most in is the ones I got open. Like Earl Grey's, Ignis's, The Real Pew, Titan Fox and Primrose. And then I'm also a sub at uh, iChase and the Majash. But they were kind of late streamers, so uh, at least for me and my schedule so it's not always I manage to watch them but I'll uh, I like to support them they're good guys even though Majaj had this uh, ego trip on his uh, uh, on this Salem witch which I didn't quite like You do know that the uh, U.S. Uh, battleships are uh, are um, brawlers, right, Marbius? They're not snipers. Yes, yeah. Get, get in. No, no. Yeah. I'm not going to go punch you up the middle, but I'll, I'll lead you. Oh, I see a stuck my ogi. I think that's also a lot of the reasons why I'll manage to get some good hits a lot of times is that I can see on a lot of hulls if they're stuck or if they're upgraded. Like a stock Congo, if you can't citadel that, you're doing something wrong. It's so freaking easy to citadel. Yeah, it's just, I'm just still learning a lot of the... Oh, didn't give it enough I mean, I mean, this ship is so slow. Floating brick. You barry? Really? Oh, he said he was sorry, so that's okay. Let's see, eight seconds out. Should be around there. Let's see how those hit. Not gonna nip in the ass. I think they did something with the aiming on the... or the... 
shell, shell travel time because there's a lot of shots I normally should hit that I'm not hitting as consistently as I used to. Furry taco. So I see I'm going down the eight nine line now on like Sir Track Song. Is it? Oh, I just said it told them. Twenty four thousand no twenty two thousand in one salvo. Yummy. Uh, Desert Wolves, I'm uh, I've unlocked the sumo, but I refuse to buy the thir third because it's so freaking bad. I don't think I'm gonna like it at all. Oh, Isokaz at 5.3 kilometers. He's launched torpedoes at me, guaranteed. Mr. Yubari, that was uh, great work. I think I was too aggressive there, telling me I'm a brawler. I got well, committed. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, there's a difference between shaving and cutting off your entire head. Yeah, a few pointers while we're playing. But you are a brawler with the uh, ship, so... You just need to... It's like I've been trying to... Uh, to tell uh, Earl Grey. You need to have an exit strategy whenever you're going in with a battleship. Like, for instance, me, I... I had already looked at the map and seen that I had space to turn around if I had to. Which I did because of the Isakasa. And that, uh, by having that exit strategy, I can get away out of trouble much faster than, for instance, if you don't. It's going really slow, so. Well, I expect us to keep going around that flank, but all the cruisers seem to go in a different direction. Yeah. Oh, no citadels. I went too far, what I should have done was stopped at the 8 line and used that other island on the right and I could have turned into that to get cover if I needed it. Yeah. That's where I'll... But, you know, the best players aren't the ones that do the best game actually, it's the ones that manage to learn from their mistakes. Oh yeah, I'm always analysing. Oh, come on, 890 HP left? Yeah, that's the one I was hammering. Sorry. 
So you've been playing this since beta then, easy? Yeah, I had uh, 550, 60 battles in beta. And how many you got now? Mm, almost 2,400. <laughs> I don't even have 400 yet. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, yeah, I've got some experience. I'm, I'm doing alright, I'm doing alright. <laughs> But yeah, I got some uh, some experience in the game, you might say. Well, while we're fleeted, up. If you see me doing anything glaring, point it out. Well, I, I'm all about helping people improve their gameplay. So that's also why it's no problem when people are asking in uh, chat what to do with ships and everything. Uh, I just find it. Nice to be able to help. Yeah, the upgrades I've got for the New York are the um, the main battery detonation thing and the firing range. Yeah, that's what I'm. Where I should get the get the third one. I don't know. Well, the third one is kind of uh, if it's yeah, the, it's, like it's not really needed. It and, yeah. yeah, that's what I thought. I normally use the damage control just uh, because reduced fire is reduced fire and I hate being on fire. Yeah, that's so true. You know the um, the upgrades on these ships? Yeah. Do they have like, you know, like World of Tanks, do they have like tier 2 counterparts? So when you progress through the tree, like down the line? No. The, the ones that you've got now become obsolete or are they all used? The ones that I've got on the New York? For example, I could use on the Montana, for example. In some cases, or is there, or is there a different version? It may not be the best module to have. But in, in, in some theory, cases, they right, carry okay. over, but in others, you need to have a totally different ones. Like yeah, a different, uh, a different skill setup. But you could, in theory, use the same. Yeah. yeah you got, so they're you, not like they, they don't become obsolete. No, most like of them they don't. Do, like, like they do it in World of Tanks, because in World of Tanks it was like they had like a, a tier two and a tier three variant, didn't they? Like a yeah, a, 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 you know, like the same but an upgraded version of, for example. Does that make sense? Yeah. No, it's not that way in uh, World of Warships. Right, okay. Yeah, but, but 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 different modules are more suited to different ships as you go down the line. Yeah, uh, like the range upgrade, you can use up to, uh, I'd use it up to about tier uh, 7. And then on uh, the North Carolina, I'd swap the range out for uh, the, um, the AA mod. Right, okay. Just because the uh, North Carolina has a really awesome AA. Yeah, so it just enhance, makes it even better, yeah. Yeah, it's like I'm, I always say that you pr try to improve what's best on what, the ship. What the ship is good at, yeah, yeah. absolutely. And you don't try Where, to... Whereas the New York isn't very good with AA, so you really want the... Especially in the lower tiers, it seems to need that range to be yeah, and it competitive. And it has a really bad range as well. Yeah, yeah. Nice you'd, never, you'd, you'd never hit anything, would you, without the bloody thing? No, you won't be able well, to you, hit... You take so long getting into combat anyway, because it's such a slug. Yeah. So slow comparatively, or it feels, you know, it's slow for its tier, I guess. Yeah. Whereas, like with the Wyoming, I found that you could generally keep up with the fleet, whereas the the New York, you've got to try and dictate where the fleet goes and dictate, which is difficult when you're in a lower tier match. I mean, it took me like five minutes in the one I was in previously because it was all tier six and seven ships I was with. <laughs> like we're all racing off, and it's just like <laughs> chugging along off behind them. Yeah, and the American line doesn't get fast before you hit uh, tier eight either. They all go around 20, 21 knots. Yeah. yeah. So What's the Congo going? Out of interest. Thirty. Thirty. Wow, that's a huge difference, isn't it? And the range on the guns is, is superior, I guess, as well. Yeah. Are they more accurate? Because I find the dispersion on the uh, on the New York to be worse than the Wyoming as well. Well, yeah, I don't know uh, what to say there. Um, I find them pretty good for everything. What's that? The 
I find the the US guns are better at close range. Yeah. But the Japanese excel at range. Yeah. I suppose it's it's classic like the uh, like World of Tanks, the, the German line versus the Russian line. Yeah. Like the, the sniper versus you know, as you say, the, the IS seven was the was the brawler with a big gun. Yeah. That's a pretty fair comparison. Oh, this guy's gotta hate me. They've been trying to dodge and torpedo bomb me now. <laughs> yeah, you do well dodging those, I've seen. And that's another thing with a New York, it's very difficult to to avoid. I wonder how many torpedoes I've dodged now. I think that's probably the fifth fifth volley. Hey, I, I got Confederate. They're kinda in the corners. Yeah, I'm kind of hoping somebody else is going to be able to kill off those uh, stupid uh, that stupid Omaha, so it doesn't become a draw. We got five minutes left. Battle ends in five minutes. We just keep that cruise. Again. Yeah, yeah, good luck, chaps. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, ouch. Go, go, secondaries. Oh, he's going for a wrap. Inbound. Yeah, I'll see. Close quarters expert, that's my first one. Nice. But I didn't get a double kill. Oh, oh, oh. oh. I might be dead now. It's freaking impossible to kill that Hosho, no Langley, but a uh, close quarter expert, confederate and high caliber. Mm -hmm. GG. <laughs> Very nice. So now it's down to these aircraft carriers. One is border humping. And the other one is what? Sneaking around. They yeah. should have be been moving down into the cap. Yeah, well, at least they got uh, the like Langley now, so it's just uh, the last ship left. Which is kind of good. Oh, I'm all sweaty after that battle. <laughs> was dodging a few shots. I was going to say, all that turning. 
Yeah, that might be to go wrong. And this is actually my first uh, close quarter expert uh, achievement. Now, let's see. If I go down there and I press this. Um, Roger, Dodge, look away. You don't know me. To know that I know this, okay? <laughs> I think I got about 50 high caliber awards or something. <clears throat> to be honest, I should have focused on the Omaha when I had taken down one of the aircraft carriers. Did well, dude. Did really well. Dodged all them torps. <laughs> Good job. Yeah, but like the last torp drops, they tried a few manual drops. I noticed, I saw on the spread. Mm -hmm. And they tried a few uh, auto drops. When their manual drops couldn't hit me, and their auto drops couldn't hit me. There's a lot of torps though, he touched a lot. Yeah, this might be a highlight. <laughs> I would put it as a highlight. <laughs> Torp dodging for the win. Let's see. I mean, uh, <laughs> secondary secondary yeah, aircraft carrier as well. Uh, Thirty thousand in uh, aircraft carrier? Or no, in uh, secondary damage. <laughs> Thirty thousand. Wow. Yeah. Wow. And just, I <laughs> just making circles around them. <laughs> 